Uh, hello guys, today in this video we will learn how to use VS Code. This video is for absolute beginners. So in this video I will be covering all the important features of VS Code that you need to know as a beginner. And I will also explain to you how this actually works with folders and files. Okay, so let's uh, start with the video. So this is a VS Code screen that you will see when you first install VS Code. So first, uh, let's see the tabs on the left here. This is the activity bar. So the first option here is of the Explorer. So when you click on it, uh, this is the place where you will see any folders or files that you're working on. So now to open a folder in VS Code, we have an option over here. Okay, you can either use this or you can go to File and say Open Folder. So you can open any folder that you want to work with or any um, content or your project folder that you have. Just select the folder and your folder is open now. To see that, just open Explorer and here you'll be able to see the project or the, sorry, the folder name. For me, it is project one. Okay, so now the folder that is over here, that is my project one is opened in VS Code. Now let's uh, make a new file called index.html. Index uh, so this option here is used to make new files and this option here is used to make a new folder. Okay, so we made a file index.html. Now if you go back to your folder there, then that particular file is created. So this is how Visual Studio Code works. Like if you open a folder and you make any changes in the, that, like you create a new file, you add images or you do stuff like that, then it is going to reflect here because you have opened this folder itself in Explore, uh, Visual Studio. So for example, here also if we create a new folder, uh, let's say a test folder and we go back to Visual Studio Code and here you see uh, the test folder is created. Okay, so this is how your folders and files work in VS Code. So you can also create a folder from here itself. Just click on this and let's say new a folder. And if you come here, you'll see the folder is being created. So I hope you understand this. As a beginner, I know it is a bit difficult to understand this thing. So this is how you open folders and work with uh, folders and files in VS Code. Now, here, if you type something, then you see it gives us a lot of options. Okay, you just wrote HTML and here if you click on HTML5, you see it already gave us the boilerplate code that we need. Here, for example, you type H1. There are so there is an option for H1 element. Or if you just type H, then there are many options over here. You can just uh, move your arrow down and just click on uh, enter and you get that tag done. So this makes it very easy for a web developer or a programmer to code. So we can just close the welcome screen. So this is how your files and folders work. Now the second option here is the search option. So when you click on it uh, and let's say we search for document and this is basically used to search in our files or folders that we have over here. Now if you keep this open, we have this document over here. And this is what it is showing. So if you see, this is highlighted over here. All right. And it is also showing the file name that is uh, that it is present in. Now, the third option here is um, for the Git control. Now, if you guys are not familiar with what GitHub is and how to uh, upload your code to GitHub and how to push uh, repositories to GitHub, then I have a video on it and I will link it in the description box below. You can go and watch that video. So this is uh, used for git like if you um, commit something and if you like push or make some changes or make a new branch and everything those things will be shown over here now this option is uh, for debug like for example if you have a uh, something uh, like a javascript file in which you have written a lot of code and now you want to debug something this is a tab that will help you do that and the last one over here is the extension um, tab so here you can search for different uh, extensions. So let's say prettier. Uh, so this is a code formatting um, extension, you can say. Extension is basically uh, something that will add more features to your VS code. 
so that is where your extensions come in place for example if you are writing liquid code for shopify but uh, the vs code doesn't know how to format it so you can just install a new extension just type in liquid and you will see ling liquid language support shopify liquid template snippets and all those things will get as an extension okay so this is where extension come in place you just need to click on install and it will be installed all right so that is how you use uh, these uh, tabs over here uh, now this is for your account and this is to manage the different things in the vs code uh, for example you can change like you can see all the uh, keyboard shortcuts here and you can change the theme from your file icon theme and different things you can just go through these settings it is just normal settings that we have in a phone these are settings for our visual studio code so this is how your vs code works so i hope this video helped you guys uh, this was just a basic explanation of how a vs code works for a beginner so if you know these things then you will pretty much be good to start using vs code as a web developer or as a programmer so i hope this video helped and if you guys um, got to learn at least one new thing from the video then please do not forget to press that like button also subscribe to my channel i'll be coming up with uh, similar videos so thank you so much guys for sticking till the end uh, see you in the next video till then bye